Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This video is going to be a more different topic. I just felt like talking about this because I haven't uploaded in a while and they have four days till school, so I want to get a little bit of content in. So recently, over the past few months, Amtrak has been copywriting games that have been using their logos massively, including massive games. Today, the same thing just happened with Real Skill Sandbox. Every single logo has been removed on every single train. And as you can see, it says most trains are blank for branding reasons. We are working to restore decals. So almost every single train does not have decals because of this copyright takedown. Now these, these trains are the Amtrak trains that have now, as you can see, been renamed to Amtrain. Sort of like Rails and Universe renaming to Amrail, etc. They have now been renamed to Amtrain to avoid copyright. As you can see, they posted this on their Discord server. If you want to pause, you can read that. There has been multiple copyright strikes from Amtrak on games that are really big. Here's another message, you might want to pause to read that. But massive games are getting copyrighted by these by these railroad companies like Real Scale Sandbox now, Softline District, etc. And this is going to continue to happen. There has been many people slender Hey wait, that's my server, which you should most definitely join in the link below. But there has been a lot of people that are not very happy about this. Many people in these real scale community games want their trains to have proper logos, but as you can see, this game has had every single logo. Like this Metrolink train, this BNSF SD40, and that NS-9. Those are just some of the examples. Almost every single train looks like this. All the logos are gone, etc. This is going to continue to happen to major real scale games like Real Scale Sandbox. It's already happened with Southline and other different games. And this is going to continue to happen unless we stop using these companies' logos. Now I know it sucks for the average player, but using these companies' logos is still not allowed. It, it does suck, as you can see, Real Skill Sandbox and the Southland District are big games looking at the view count, but it does not mean they can't copyright strike them. This is going to keep on happening unless we stop using their logos and resort to different names, but it's, it does suck for the average player, but it's definitely what is necessary. At this point, it's not many. I don't really care about my track. I've only seen it once in person, as you can see in this footage. Which, this footage is from the Ralph Manning channel, which you can most definitely see below on the other. This is from the Ralph Manning channel. I, I don't really care about Pastor or the Ralph Manning, the tier B commuter. start using different logos. This is going to continue. It's already happened to multiple big games that are in the next time. I'm going to start like I said earlier. These screens will give you a show for these logos to be used in the game. And we should probably resort to random things like Amrail, Amtrain, or Nelson Universe. Now, although 
though some of these trains do not have their original logos anymore, and some of them are removed or different names, like these Am this Amtrak train right here, now it says Amtrain, there has been no real changes to these locomotives. They're still the same, there hasn't been really an update besides some like bug fixes, etc. Not much to cover, but it's still pretty necessary to talk about this issue. It's been going on a lot. And, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video, this is just a quick talk about this, I just felt like talking about this. Like I said, I have four days until school again, and um, I just felt like getting some content in, I haven't uploaded in a few days. But I hope you like these commentary type videos, I'll just let this footage roll, but make sure to watch more of my Rose Girl Sandbox videos on my channel. And let me know if you like my new style of... Um, thumbnails. I'm trying to fix those as well. But like I said, do not attack Amtrak for this or any companies doing the same thing. They did use their logos at the end of the day without permission. And this is just an issue that should be talked about because it's very common now within the Rose Hill community. Games are getting copyright straight to left and right by these railroads. Anyways, that's all for today in my quick yap session, I guess, because... I just felt like talking about this. I don't feel like putting much effort into this video. I'll definitely do that next video. It's like 6 a.m. I couldn't sleep all tonight, so like I'm not talking as much because it's still kind of nighttime. The sun is just now rising, so I'm definitely gonna go to sleep after making this. But like I said, don't attack Amtrak for this. And make sure to not use these orders in your game, because this is just going to keep on happening to big games, it already has, and it is still happening. Make sure to watch my other Rural Skill Sandbox videos, make sure to subscribe, and I hope you guys have a good day. See ya.